What's happening people? Uh, today I'm going to go through uh, the basic mechanics of sweet picking. Um, a lot of people when they start out it, it, they find it difficult to sort of grasp the technique initially. Uh, I certainly did when I learnt it many years ago now. Um, the, uh, I think the main thing to remember is really start slow, break it down and then um, be able to speed, speed gradually. Uh, I think the most important thing to start with rather than buying straight into you know, six string arpeggios is to um, just make sure the coordination between the left and right hand is perfect. If you get that down slow, and you make sure you're doing all upstrokes or downstrokes depending if you're uh, ascending or descending the arpeggio, then um, you'll find it much easier as you grasp it and get up to speed. There's no point in picking an arpeggio and going down, 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 picking it all with separate strokes, which a lot of people tend to do. You just need to make sure that when the pick leaves the one string, in either descending or ascending, uh, downwards or upwards, it needs to the weight of it needs to naturally bring the pick to the next string. So I'll show you what I mean. We're going to start off with a basic A minor arpeggio uh, over five strings, and all I'm doing, if you watch my hand, even at that speed, the natural weight of the pick leaving the one string is moving it to the next string and sounding the next note. So rather than picking each note individually. Uh, before you even start this, you might just want to practice scraping your arm up and down each string to make sure that you're not picking it like a chord and that you're not individually picking the notes or even also picking the notes. Uh, so just make sure you get a good solid motion going first before you attempt to synchronise the left hand up with your right hand. Uh, yeah, that's basically it. If you get that down, um, I'm not going to show you the shapes per se, because you can find them out anywhere on the internet. Uh, but if you just look for some the basic major shapes, basic minor shapes, easiest shapes to start with is probably the, the major uh, three string arpeggio. And then you can add on other strings and tapping sequences to that and uh, all sorts. Okay, so yeah, that's the basic mechanics of it, the basic motion. Uh, if you focus on what I've said here, when you start out, and you, and you practice consistently, I think you'll find that you, you quickly pick it up. At first, it seems like you're never going to grasp it and that you know, you're just going to carry on forever and you're, not, and you're sort of panicking. Uh, but eventually, it will come. And just if you stick with that, make sure that the weight of the pick's carrying to the, the sound of the next note on the adjacent string uh, rather than an individual pick stroke, and that your left and right hands are synchronised. <laughs> then um, yeah, it'll be fine. Alright, cheers, yeah, if you like this video, please like and subscribe to the channel. Uh, I'm doing daily uploads uh, of lessons and uh, bits and pieces, so yeah, please check that out, and uh, yeah, peace.